I had that dream under that tree that I was going to be successful. Under that same tree, I was witnessing a lot of people being cruel and mean to each other. Just hatred. And that's just my childhood. That's all I've seen. When I got him, he was six months. His mom said she don't need kids. He can die or DCF can take him. In middle school, he was a very tough kid. A lot of fights, always in trouble, constantly suspended. I was like trapped. I never seen a positive future. I would go to school and one of my friends is not there and they'll tell me, oh, he got shot. I was 12 years old, this car rolled down our block. Windows rolled down, I started hearing gunshots. Everything started moving in slow motion. This one night really was when I figured out, I gotta get out of here. You losing friends, losing family members. It's like, am I gonna be next? It was time to make that 180. I stopped getting in trouble in school. Started focusing more. It really changed my life. I wanted to have an impact through my story. Let me help every child think about their future because we're in this area. Don't think you're the next one. Break that cycle. When it ain't for the stars. He's the pride of our city. Kids like Jackson save a lot of children, far more than a mayor's ever going to do. His whole life has been about fighting against the current. He's conquered this room like he has his entire life. When the opponent has me, when I'm stuck, I always tell myself, this is it. Are you gonna sit here and let someone else beat you? Or are you gonna give it all that you got? I made that transition to get out, make it out the hood. Same thing when I'm wrestling. When I'm stuck, I gotta make that same flip. Flip my opponent, flip my life, and I get on top.